Good morning, good afternoon, everyone. It's Ankit. Whenever or wherever you're watching this video, thank you for taking the time out of your busy schedule to watch today's video. I hope everyone's having the best day or the best week of their life. If you found value and are excited about today's video, make sure you hit the subscribe button for more videos like this. Today, I just want to do a quick video on three dividend stocks that you can buy to get paid every month. This could help you get that extra pay raise that you always wanted, help you fight inflation, or just give you that extra boost of money whenever you need it. But keep in mind to buy when it's low, find a good entry point. Don't just go in blindfolded, do your research about these three stocks I'm talking about. And keep in mind this is for only dividends. And it's good if you reinvest your dividends, but that's really up to you how you want to do your portfolio. Let me know in the comments below with what your favorite dividend stock is and why. Let's try to hit 3,000 subscribers in three months. With all that out of the way, let's get into today's video and talk about these three dividend stocks that you can incorporate in your portfolio to get paid every month. Keep in mind you need to have all three of these stocks or future stocks that I talk about that pay within those months in order to get paid every month. You can't just have one and get paid every month. The first stock on our list is Ultra, which is um, the world's largest producer and ma marketers of tobacco products, cigarettes, and other related products. So if you go to their main website, and we'll also open up their ticker. So here's their main website, Moving Beyond Smoking. Yes, I don't recommend smoking, but this stock does pay a nice dividend of 8. 1.9%. The PE ratio is high 45.23. Over the 5 years it's down 32%. Over the 1 year it's down 7.86%. When we look at their financials, they did BDPS. They barely missed earnings of for revenue. They do have a lot of cash on hand, so this is why they're able to pay a lot of money to the shareholders. You can go to their main website under the investors tab and check out all the financial information and have access to all this other information, dividend information. What else do they have? Uh, tools and calculators. So many other tools for you investors that invest in the stock or consider investing in the stock. So it's all available to you on their website. So the day you can expect your dividends is, or in the past have been, June 14th, March 24th, December 22nd, and September 14th. The next stock you can add to your list is AT&T, currently trading at 18.46. It does pay a nice dividend of 6.01. The PE ratio is low, 6.90. Market cap is $130 billion. One year chart, it's down 12%. Uh, five year chart's down 36.33. We look at their financials. They did beat earnings last quarter. They do have a lot of cash on hand, but they do have a lot of debt too. So let's look at when they pay their dividends. So the company pays out its dividends in July, April, January, and October, as you can see. From here. In the last stock we're going to talk about today is Enbridge Inc. ENB pays a dividend of 6.04, PE ratio is 23.51. It is a multinational pipeline company which is headquartered in Canada but it owns and operates pipelines throughout Canada and the US and transports uh, oil natural gas, and natural gas liquids. Over the one year, it is up 13%. Over the five years, it's up 6% in the max to uh, 528. Let's look at their financials. It does have 134 billion, 294 increase, net change in cash. It did miss EPS by 3.59%, beat revenue by 7.29%, Let's look at when they paid their dividends. 
So Enbridge pays out its dividends in May, February, November, and August. So let me repeat that. May, February, November, and August. It pays out its dividends. And as you can see over here, it's been slightly increasing its dividends throughout the years.